It's a little sexy here at Sundance this year. On the screen, that is. Lots of movies that are being buzzed about are very sexy themed movies. It's getting pretty hot here at Sundance this year. First of all, let's talk Daniel Radcliffe. Holy Harry Potter, Batman. Not anymore. I mean, he is playing a young Allen Ginsberg in Kill Your Darlings. He's getting rave reviews for this, but in this movie, not only is he naked, there is a gay sex scene, there's some other sex scenes, there's some drug use, and then there's also some making out with his co-star, who happens to be a man. So Daniel Radcliffe is really going all out and really kind of trying to shed that whole Harry Potter uh, image with this movie. We've also got James Franco, another big-name actor who's exploring a little bit of his freak factor here at Sundance. First of all, he's got two projects here. We are going to spank you because it feels good. The number one kink. It's this movie about kinkiness, about kind of people's sexual fantasies and the things that they desire and, and showing it in a little bit of a different light, not the seedy underworld that we think of, but just showing you that these people who have these fantasies are just like your next door neighbor, everyday people. Then there's interior leather bar. Don't, don't show gay sex. And this film pretty darn interesting. It's a documentary that kind of repurposes and reimagines the 40 minutes of lost footage from the 1980 movie Cruising with Al Pacino. This he made with uh, director Travis Matthews and it's I have to say a very interesting look at what these 40 minutes of lost film may have. Then of course we've got the biopic Lovelace. How to Joy sex. This is a look, arguably the most famous porn star of them all, Linda Lovelace. Amanda Seyfried plays the main character, and that's getting a lot of buzz here. And then there's Joseph Gordon-Levitt's directorial debut in his film that he also stars in, Don John's Addiction. It's about a sex addict who's trying to change his life. This also has Scarlett Johansson and Julianne Moore. Lots of buzz about that here at Sundance, too. So if that's not enough for you... I don't know what is because, like I said, getting pretty hot here at Sunday. Yeah. Lots of sex going on on the screen.